Wandering Winder here with some Dominion and oh me oh my oh what is the sky um I think I want to open pageant and probably silver Enchantress looks worse with the Necropolis around to tank and attack um, but we want to get Mountebanks up and going Yeah, this is not the amount of money we're looking for. It's probably okay. Um, do I want to take a Sage here? I think I'm going to take a Sage rather than another Silver. Okay, we do hit Mountebank now. Yeah. And... I mean, I guess we pile on a bunch of Sages. At some point I'm going to worry about Vineyard stuff but only at some point. Um, we haven't seen the silver yet, so this is going to find us this silver. We will take a second mountebank, but we're already starting to feel the pain of... okay, the pain of going second, but this helps because we get to block, and you may not. Now you have a choice to make. Do you go for gold? Do you go for governor? Do you go for one of these cards? Are you eventually going to be heading for vineyard, which makes some sense with way of the rat around? Although, I don't know, maybe not because, maybe less sense. Um, going for a villa. Interesting. Well, I would assume then that you would have a, a haggler or something, or your other mountebank in hand. I'm slightly confused as to why... what are we waiting for from your turn? Oh. Well, it does not. <laughs> it's the end of your buy phase. Yeah, you don't have the end of your buy phase, so... Um, right. I probably want some kind of a five cost here. There are a million points available. Silk Road's not so hot, though. I guess we pick up a Haggler. We do also have to think about eventually things are going to pile out. Wow, okay, you have the hovel, which is the only way this makes sense. I don't think I'm so keen on the governor. Okay, so sage, sage, we go haggler. So this is six money. It's going to be eight. This is going to make it nine. So I think what we want to buy a five with the villa. No, we want to go villa and then just pick up. Yeah. Villa with a another sage. guess we could have done this the other way. No. Um, and now I, I think I'm in for Potion and Sage. Hold on to some... Uh, I should probably have taken a Market Square. I'm going to want some Plus Buy coming up. We're going to have Pile pile, sure, pile, pile, and then these can run, so like, we're going to not want to wait on to scoring too much longer. That is a little bit of interesting, though, because 
Um, well, it's the end of your by phase. So you don't hit the end. You hit the beginning of your by phase, but you don't hit the end. I guess when you go back, it's kind of weird. Should be like it, it would just make more sense if it was like at the beginning of your cleanup or something. Be a little bit less rule confusy. The vineyards are worth about three at the moment. You're ratting Hagler. You're going to get Villa and Sage. You're spending a lot of your coffers here. And we know you have a Mount of Ank in hand. I don't. I don't think I love this play, though. Okay, and you're going to go Potion Market Square. Oh, Enchantress, okay. You discard there. I think, yeah, because we have the hovel here, we'll do this. Ooh, this is not good. You can do this rat villa stuff. You're going to end your turn here. Okay. Curses are not going well. I mean, I have more villagers than you, is the nice thing. Um, five, so this would be six. Or I can I think of what I want to do is rat some by a market square, so I can do this once more. Okay, a little surprised that you stopped there. Um, can I win here? So I play Hagler and nothing else. I spend three coffers. I buy Duchy. I haggle this. So then I have a villa in hand. I can rat the remaining, right? I can rat the remaining villas. And I win by emptying the curses here. Although I, I think I can actually buy a state even. Um, but, yeah, this works out. Uh, <laughs> weird. <laughs> Villa Rat does stuff and, huh. Yeah, so I wasn't lying earlier when I said you gotta worry about the game ending. Uh, okay. Um, interesting, weird stuff, stuff, stuff. Thanks for watching.